All right, hello YouTubers. It is me, Trollface the Man, and we're going to have a discussion about how to set up battles, NPC battles in Gary's mod. Now, first things first, uh, I'm going to go ahead and I'm gonna enable both uh enable where is it at? Ability settings, god mode and flying. So, I can go ahead and just fly around here. Now, if you want to go ahead and you want to set up NPCs, you know that can be kind of a pain to go ahead and try and spawn them down. For like, let's say if I take these uh, rebels here. Uh, where are the rebels at? Human plus resistance, there we go. Alright, so I'm going to take uh, these rebels here. They have guns? Yeah, they have guns. I'm just going to spawn a couple down like this. Uh, no, you guys go right there. Now, if I try, this one thing right here, they want to follow me. If I try and spawn down some combines for them to fight, instantly they'll go ahead and they'll engage each other, making it very difficult to go ahead and stage a battle like that. Now, I'm going to remove these guys real quick. Now, there's a very simple way to do that. All you need to do is go to Hold Q, go to NPCs, and Disable Thinking. Also, Ignore Player is very useful. So make sure they don't just end up shooting you. So, if I disable thinking here, what I can actually do is I can take this, and I'm just going to spawn them with the tool gun because use a little bit. I'm going to take these medics here. I can spawn them in like this. Do uh, six of them here. And I can also go ahead and uh, spawn in these combines here. Do the same thing here. One, two. Oop. Uh, I'm using tool gun. Move you two. Uh, one, two, three. You guys, just watch over your dead comrade here. You're gonna avenge him. And they'll stay in there. They won't engage each other, right? That's until I go ahead and I hit the Q menu again. NPCs, enable thinking. And then they'll go ahead and they'll start engaging each other. This allows for you to actually go ahead and to stage the actual battles. Because once again, they, these combines really suck, to be honest. But once again, this allows for you to actually you know, set up certain things. Now, you can go ahead and you can go beyond that. So, you can see the Rebels obviously won. Uh, you can go beyond that. Let's say, for instance, I want uh, zombies here. So, once again, I'm just going to disable thinking on the AI. I'm going to go to these uh, enemies. Take these zombies. Oh. A normal zombie isn't working for some reason. What in the world? Alright, well, I'm going to use these torso zombies. One, two, three, four, five, six. And once again, I'm going to take these rebels here. Um, Take this rebel here. Spawn you some tool gun. One, two, three. I'll spawn in three of them. Uh, enable thinking again. They can go ahead and they can take these guys out with ease. I mean, you can see just three of these guys take them out, no problem. Oh, we got one rebel there, actually. But yeah, you can see that uh, those zombies didn't really stand a chance there. They did get a couple of the guys, though. Um, so, how can you make this more interesting? Well, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take this, and I'm going to spawn in these zombies again. It's again, disable thinking here. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to spawn in these zombies. Uh, zombie torsos. Again. Always oh, messed that up. Spawn using two gun. There we go. Go ahead and spawn in a couple of these torsos here. And I'm gonna spawn in a couple of uh resistance members again. Except for what I'm gonna do this time is I'm gonna go up to the NPCs over here. You can hit Weapon override, and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to give them crowbars. Now I can go ahead and just click, spawn using tool gun. I spawn these guys, and you might notice that their only weapon now is a crowbar. Now to give them at least a little bit of advantage, or a hope, I'm going to go ahead and spawn six of these guys here now. So you can see they all have crowbars. We're going to go ahead and we're going to hit Q, enable thinking again, and let these guys go at it. Or maybe they'll just <laughs> run away. 
Uh, oh, way to go, guys. Way to go. I'll just... Save your asses here, because you guys are too afraid of these zombies. Take them out yourself. Alright. Oh, they're a bunch of idiots. Um, <clears throat> so, that's just very useful for going ahead and doing something like that. You know, once again, you can even out the odds. Uh, you can have, like, let's say now, we've seen that the rebels with a pistol are way better than the combine soldiers in any given way. So, why don't we match them up with the same weapon, see how they are. So, I'm going to go to Weapon Override. I'm going to go to... It's the AR2... I don't know. Um, I'm going to try this one. I think this one might be it. I'm going to take in the uh, Medics, Rebels, one, two, five. Have the same mount with the Combine Soldiers here. So, even like the police and stuff. Uh, combine soldiers. Spawn dual gun. One, two. Oops. Forgot to, uh, disable thinking there. So I'm just gonna have to do that all again. Um, humans resistance. Medic. One. Disable thinking. Spawn using tool gun. One, two, three. Three, four, five. Combine soldiers. There's some tool gun. One, two, three. Three, four, five. Now they both have the same weapons. These guys don't have pistols anymore. Both have the same weapons. We'll go ahead and we'll see if they go ahead and uh, a little bit more even now. So enable thinking. You can also use that same AI disabled, or AI zero command too, to do the same thing. But, uh, yeah, they still don't stand a chance. The Combine Soldiers are completely wiped out. So, we could tell these Rebels are pretty tough. Now, there is a funny thing. Like, if I take this Combine Elite, right, and I, uh, go to Weapon Override, and if you take a weapon that they're not normally, uh, not <laughs> normally used to using, it can go ahead and be kind of weird. Like, for instance, I'm going to take this. I'm going to spawn this Combine Soldier with a crowbar. You can see that, uh, yeah, he, he doesn't he doesn't actually have any animation for the crowbar, so he just kind of stands there like it's a gun. This other guy is just going to kind of beat the crap out of him. Or, oh, maybe not. But yeah, he, he doesn't fire that thing. If you get close, he'll go ahead and he'll melee you, but that's about it. Uh, it doesn't work for certain things, too. Like, if you get download things, like I'm going to spawn in the zombie here. No weapon here, nothing for the zombie. Uh, spawn in a drugger from Skyrim. See, it doesn't mess with that. So it is just mainly for the Half-Life 2 are the actual ones that are early implemented into Gary's mod. So that's something to keep in mind. Now, as good old-fashioned, we're going to go ahead and we're going to just, let's have a nice big fun thing here. Uh, you can actually do the disable thinking too with the, uh think you can go ahead and do disable thinking with the certain mods. Let's see if this one works. Uh, yeah, so you can see that even with some modded stuff, disabling thinking goes ahead and works. So, that's just something that's good to know. Alright, get out of here. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to we're gonna set up a little bit of a challenge. Uh, get some Combine Soldiers in here, some Rebel Soldiers, and see who goes ahead and can survive. So, be back in just a minute. This should be mentioned real quick. Um, if you go ahead and, let's say I spawn these guys in with an uh, AG-2. Um, if I go in and I go to the Weapon Override real quick, like this, and I hit Crowbar. Even if I spawn these guys again, they still have the AG-2. It won't change the ones that are already out there. You just have to re-click and hit spawn using tool gun again, and it'll spawn the uh, new guys with the new weapon. So that means you can make mixed troops, some with shotguns, some without. So uh, that's just good to know. All right, guys, so we end up getting news of a compound that has many, many combine soldiers inside of it that are waiting to ambush a few escapee rebels. We're going to go ahead and we're going to assist them here, 
and the defeat of these combine soldiers and we'll see how well we can go ahead and fight these guys off well i'm gonna go ahead and disable god mode no clip right now let's get on the ground here uh and as you can see oh gotta get out of here first as you can see we have uh all right nope why is it not all right i'll just avoid hitting the v button as you can see, we got a small army going here. We're about to go ahead and uh, take these guys out. So I'm just going to switch. I'm going to switch first. I'm going to make it where they follow me again. They don't ignore the player. They uh, join my squad. Uh, and thinking enable. If you're wondering what gun I'm using, by the way, it is from the weapons pack M9K Specialties. It's a very cool weapons pack. Check it out, the M9K uh, weapon packs. Uh, they're very fun. I recommend downloading them. You guys are terrible shots. Oh, oh, shit. Spoke too soon. Winchester. Thank you, medic. <sighs> Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah. I wish, yeah. It was a little bit better in this game. Fire. Well, good job, guys. And, uh, as for the rest of you, you're terrible. Join the fight. Alright, guys. As you can see, I was able to set up a little bit of a uh, challenge here. Even though it wasn't too much of a challenge, to be honest, those combine soldiers are rather easy to defeat. Especially if you have medics nearby. You guys were the, the good guys. You actually end up doing something. But, um, so you can see that how the disabling the eye can really help. Uh, come on out here, guys. Now, this is an M9K specialty right here. It's a nuke. It's a very, very fun one to play around with. And, uh, so we're going to end this movie strong. 
And, uh... <laughs> Take it easy, guys. Bye!